This is the War Memorial in Kings Park. And uh, actually, Kings Park is one of the largest inner city parks in the world. That's the War Memorial over there. Constructed after the World War I. Look at that! You can literally see the whole central business district of Perth. And right next to it is the river. We call it the Swan River. The wall behind me is no ordinary wall. If one person sits right here and whispers to the wall, the other person from the other end of the wall can actually listen to you as if there's one person sitting beside you talking to you. I'll show you how it works. Hello. Why are you laughing? You're behind me, where? I'm in the middle of the Hay Street and it is the main street through the central business district of Perth. Right now let's do some shopping! When you're walking along the Hay Street, you definitely encounter the London Court because it's so eye-catching. And it is a Tudor-style building because um, when the designer created this building, he intended to create a structure that, that will be a reminiscent of the British taste. And right in front of the gate, there will be um, a, a replica of the Great Clock from France. And at the other end of the building, there will be another replica of clock from Big Ben from London. It's a replica of the big band from London. Here I am at the iconic landmark of Perth, the Bell Tower. The Bell Tower isn't just a tower, it is actually the world's largest musical instrument. What I can say is that it is one of the most unique um, constructions in Perth. Um, it is also filled with a lot of fascinating historic content. And what's great is that the bell still can be heard every day. Sun Bell is ringing at the C-sharp key. 